<laughs> okay, play it again. That can get old up. real quick. <laughs> okay, we going. We're good. We're, We're pre-showing. This is the pre-show for Grok Talk, a production yeah, of. Yeah, baby. Don't interrupt me. Yeah, baby. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Why you're just gonna click on on that again? <laughs> you got that yes, figured out early. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> Oh man! Need some background. Music. So Go ahead. here, here's Skip flying through the air in more ways than one. Skip's got new blood pressure medicine, and it's making him a little crazy. <laughs> yes, if I if I seem, if I have the transparency that the Obama administration doesn't, now you know why. Ay ay ay! Overshare, overshare. Look out for overshares. Ed Nail's with us. Uh, he's going to be in and out. We have a. We actually had a guest. I didn't even know, but uh, Ed's going to fill us in on some voter fraud stuff too. And uh, Rick Olson's supposed to come by, so we can talk about some stuff. See what he's been up to. What time does Rick come in? I have no idea. Later, I suspect. Later, later. It's a good time. Okay. I know he's probably going to be at the Manchester Gun Show today. So, well, that's where Grokster Susan is right now. Got she is doing volunteer work for the Women's Defense League, of New Hampshire. Actual Women's Defense. Yes. Not faux defense. No. I forgot it was a gun show today. Yeah, this is not Moms Demand Action. These these are a bunch of ladies who mean business. Yes, uh, there, it just stopped. It's only a couple minutes long. You know, that song's actually really long. I just cut it because, you know, I use it for intros and stuff, and there's really no need to have it that long. So welcome to the pre-show. I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to go with all these little buttons I'm clicking on here, and i got to get ready for the beginning of the actual show. But uh, plenty of things we'll talk about today. Um, We're still winding down from uh, Diane Gilbert's constitutional dinner on Sunday. Yeah, that I missed, and I really wish I was there, because we had a couple of hours we could have killed. And that reminds, I might as well remind everybody to check your cap and rotor every Check your cap and rotor every 15 miles. years, yeah. Actually, 158,000. 158,000 in 15 years. On the original cap rotor and spark plugs and wires. Every time you turn that key, it was a gamble. It was. It did, and I gambled on a Saturday. And luckily, I lost mm. only about a mile and a half from my house. Oh, okay. Because <laughs> my wife came right up to get me, and I called AAA. And, and they, you, you didn't have a spare cap and rotor in the I bag? didn't have any in the glove box, no. no. Full of uh, Dunkin' Donuts napkins and maps I don't need and um, uh, my registration and stuff, so. And work is being done on the video yes. for those who are oh, still wondering. Oh, for the constitutional thing. A lot of yeah. video. And a heck of a singer there. The, Holy The girl he had cow. singing, boy, oh, boy, oh, she could, she could hit the low Hello. notes, and she'd go up and hit the high notes and then grab another high note. When you thought she was all done, she'd grab another one. So yeah, she's you, a good singer. If you remember how Whitney Houston used to sing, she has the same kind of style, but Range. has put her... The range and the intonation, the nuances, but she's got her own special. Uh, everybody was standing up and clapping. They were blow, absolutely blown away. No, she's got a, a spot in New Hampshire doing gigs like that, I'll tell you. Boy, oh boy. Uh, well, yeah, she'll give Gang Cormier a run for her money, <laughs> actually. <laughs> oh, what was her name? I Faith. Forget. Faith, and the last name was. I uh, don't. She's from we're gonna have to. We're going to have to go to the video for it's that. It's like. Yeah. Oh, I'm not even going to try. Photon or Fodu or something like that. Frodo? <laughs> no. no that's it's a face. Holy crap, you can sing. <laughs> yeah, she she can. That's she a big girl. She's six she, feet tall. And she's only a sophomore in high school. Yeah, Manchester. And that <laughs> is awesome. what... I mean, her, the ability for her to sing that way, it was yeah. just... I, I'm thinking, how young is she? And I'm listening to this, and it's like, mm. holy cow. Yep, some some kids got the gift. Did I say Kathy Rago's going to be on? You did. Is it Rago or Rago? I think it's Rago. Rago? And she is running... Then she must say tomato. In my... Rago, tomato, potato. New Hampshire State District. Yes. She is looking to unseat Andrew Hosmer, the Which Democrat. is a worthy, worthy cause. Uh, what district number is that? Don't ask me hard questions. I'm sorry. Not That's, today. Uh, How many fingers Obama am I holding Hosmer. up? <laughs> <laughs> um, Obama Hosmer, yes. Obama Hosmer. I mean, you have to associate Go ahead. all of them do, with Obama. Do, do that once more. How many fingers? Yeah. You've got two <laughs> different, three opportunities to get this right. Nine. Nine, exactly. <laughs> yeah, he can do math. He's good. Yeah. Let's see. Three here. Three there. That's, i got to get used to... S three. Yeah. yeah see. Three there. Oh, so three there. Screen. And three there. Right. Yeah. Nine. Nine. 
Do I get a no, gold nine star? Is German for that's no. German for no. Yeah, you lose. <laughs> nine. <laughs> it's math, not language. It's, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Okay. So for the pre-show, guys, I'm going to be playing. Le- oh, that actually looks pretty good this time. It does. Look at a joke. Does. You got a joke? Go yeah, ahead. the Go. police went to break up a surfer party and they arrested four and hanged ten. <laughs> okay. okay. I didn't say it was wait. a good joke, did I? <laughs> no. Oh, wait. Here. Um. Uh, yeah, yeah. That's the pre-show. You get what you get. <laughs> Pitchforks. Yes. Pitch Pitchforks. Pretty sure. See, this is, I guess I should have <laughs> played that one, huh? What's next? How many of those you got? Don't a lot. Me, yeah. Actually, yeah, that's we, just on yes. the front page. Yeah, we gave him new software a while ago. Thank you to whoever donated the money. Very much so. so. Actually, we've been getting a few donations. I do want to make a call I'm out sorry. To, the, to the folks who from the Seacoast GOP organizations that almost everybody has sent a check to wow. Granite Rock to help us get new stuff. I said we, we Keep got the one. lights on, pay the bills. We got a uh, donation guy called up uh, from Massachusetts. I did a voter fraud workshop down in um, Lexington, Massachusetts. And the reason I do those is because people always give me tips from Massachusetts. Mm-hmm. And one fellow says, uh, can I talk to you after this is over? I said, sure. He goes, tell me why my wife is a voter in a small town in New Hampshire. <laughs> and I said, how do you know? He said, we're getting mail. You know, it's, it's addressed to her, and we get it down here. But uh, so... He's going to get me some more details. I know what town. I know the name. i got to get the birth date and some other stuff and do a little research on why someone is voting in her name and has her registered in uh, northern New Hampshire. It it's is always fun to go to Massachusetts because everybody has a story for you. Oh, yeah. It's like... Uh, but my neighbor votes in Pembroke. Okay, that, uh, thank you very much. That girl from Ludlow, who's probably never even been in New Hampshire, who voted, has continuously been registered in Massachusetts since 2006 or something, and yep. for some strange reason voted here in 2012. Absentee. Surprise, so anyway, when right. you told your joke, this is what I was supposed to play. Yeah, that's a joke, son. Don't you get it? I made a funny son, and you're not laughing. <laughs> My favorite guy. <laughs> so. Ah. Foghorn Leghorn. Now we have something new. You asked me what district it was. Now you can look at the live stream, and we have the answer. This Kathy Rago, District 7. Seven, that's my old district. Yeah, and I forgot about this feature that uh, we can do picture in picture. Oh, yes. So, yes, yes. I, had, I had forgotten that we I had set this up. Right. Now we need the people to donate money so we can get rid of the ads on the stream. <laughs> well, there's also a brand new version of Producer Pro that's out there. It's about $500. But that would allow us to use IP cameras, you mm-hmm. know, network cameras, so we could get little drop cams. Put them, put them around the. No, that's poker. Okay. Right? But we could put them up on the wall, and I would have. We'd have very much more. Very much more. Oh, God. Okay, keep going. More wires? More choices. No, wireless this time. Wow. That's the but, way to go. But if we what go. I'm seeing. But what if we. So we could stream, <laughs> we could just stream direct right from here without having to go through you stream? That would No, no. Right. That would come to the laptop. And then uh, we'd be able to pick those views to be able to get better. Then you say something about but maybe being able to use YouTube? Actually, there's a new feature in those, too, because it'll automatically post to YouTube. So like everything else, about the time you learn to use this stuff, it's defunct and you're on to the next program. Kind of. Well, this one I've had for a couple of years. The new version's been out for six months, but it's $500. Ooh. And given that I just spent a whole gob of money for some other stuff that we had to take care of, I don't have it. And the children are shoeless. <laughs> we get about 30 seconds before we actually start the show. Oh, really? Yeah, really. Well, that's really, cool. Really, now 29. So we're, uh, we're going to come right back and probably repeat ourselves because that's just how we're going to have to do it. You pre-show people are just lucky to know what's happening before it happens. So stay tuned. We'll be right back. Clock TV. 